Hey! Video! Kon is dan vol kamer! Wij stoppen er nou weer spel lekker weer de big zipper hoor. Dat de gymmeister op en hier leiden de pack. The city is fantastic and the people are lovely and the food is brilliant. The architecture is fantastic, I mean the mosques are, are just beautiful to look at. Um, there's, a lot of, there's a lot of lovely architecture around the place. Traveling around the city is fantastic, it's very easy to get around, there's constantly buses going, I mean if the bus is driving off you can still just hop in the door if need to be and they nearly respect you for it. There's always one on the go so if you ever need to get anywhere there's, there's never a problem. So, and it, well, the people are lovely and friendly as long as you know, you're not driving around the city because the, <laughs> they're crazy. Good evening, reporting here live from CNN Turk in Istanbul, Turkey. I mean, CNN is known internationally, worldwide as a phenomenal place to be able to get an opportunity to, to showcase your talent. I wasn't really sure what to expect. So I didn't really know what I was getting myself into. I didn't know exactly what we'd be doing because we were divided into three groups. There was two was on the cultural show and then there was two on kind of like a political um, university uh, show and then uh, I'm on the Bayat show. <laughs> Bir hafta daha çıkartmaz herhalde bu adam biz diye ama üniversiteleri yine onlara saydıracağım. Sevgili Frank ve Fiona'yı alkışlarla buraya... <gülüyor> The Bayer show is kind of like, it's kind of like a Graham Norton type show. Artık zamanı geldi, bırak, bırak. Artık zamanı geldi. 
It's a lot of fun. Thank you. Thank Merhaba. Merhaba. <laughs> yeah. yeah. And the people on the crew, the, the production team, they're all really, really nice. They're, they're friendly, they're good crack. You have been very lucky, actually, because you could have ended up at a complete different show with mother-in-laws and crazy brides. So how come you, you are at Bea's show? Did you prefer it yourself, or how did this happen? Bea himself, even though he doesn't speak in English, he seems like really nice from what we have from our interactions with him. Bill. Not Bill Kent. <laughs> Bill Kent. Bill Kent. Yeah. Bill Kent. <laughs> One thing that we have to do for the Bayad show, during the show, uh, when you, we have about 800 um, people who come in as a live audience, and um, what we have to do is we have to, you know, kind of direct them where to go for the, you know, where they can sit, um, and then we have to, you know, we have to hand them out paper and pencils and things like that, and we have to, you know, tell them, you know, write down your answers to whatever question you're going to ask and all this sort of stuff, and then we have to go around and collect them and all that, and they're kind of, it's not so much. That's not difficult, I mean, it's only kind of like, give me the piece of paper, that's fine. But it's when they ask you a question and they're kind of like, you know, why don't you understand me? Um, so it's definitely the language barrier is, is uh, one thing that'll get in the way. The program I'm working on with CNN Turk is called Office. It is the arts and culture program. There are such amazing different aspects to the culture over here, from the different instruments they play. the different art. The theater. We were recently at the red carpet. Uh, the red carpet was the Istanbul Film Festival award ceremony. Uh, myself and my colleague Joseph went there and we um, helped in any way possible to the rest of our team to make the overall red carpet experience work a little bit better for them and also to enjoy it ourselves. Our uh, main presenter, who was a model of Turkey in 2001, Nafise Karatay, she's a main presenter. And our secondary presenter is Anul Kurtmandu. Um, I've been working with Anul since I came over here, and he's brought me out anytime he's been going out to interview um, artists, actors, filmmakers, photographers directors, he's always brought me along, he's interviewed the people, sometimes he's been with them at the interview and sometimes he's been off camera, but he's, he's so professional, he presents himself so well, he's so ca cool, calm and collected, it's unbelievable as to how, how everything just gets pulled together by, by, by this gentleman. The cultural highlight for me was at my trip, my day trip to Ephesus. That's a fantastic place and I advise anyone who gets a chance to go there. Um, I'm even planning on going back in a few years because they're still, you know, excavating the place and you know they you can see that they're still working on different little um, parts of it. So um, it's just amazing to go there and see the architecture and just think that they were capable of doing such uh, such amazing um, amazing work back then. Probably the, the highlight of my three weeks working here, I probably have two. 
One would be um, attending and participating in the red carpet event, which was um, the Istanbul Film Festival Award Ceremony. And the other one would probably have to be when we went to see the guys making artificial parts for a theatre production. Uh, they are making um, a person, uh, so they had the head and the hands, and they were dressed in the hands, they, they made a, a clay mould out of a head and a hand, and then they sculpted it to look exactly like the person they, were, they wanted to impersonate. Then they, they coloured the face, they gave him blue eyes, they put hair into his head, it was so convincing, if you didn't know, you'd think it was. Once I am working in the real media world itself, I'll be able to put everything I've seen here into practice. Um, everything that I've been uh, taught during the year of my advanced media course, I'll be able to put that also into practice. And hopefully it'll make me a better journalist or person involved in media circles, wherever it, I may be. It's, it's going to be a great help when I'm trying to look for work later on. Uh, in life and um, th that's really it and what I hope to do with it is just as much what I said is just use it to my advantage when I'm trying to get um, another college course next year or I'm trying to get into work after that college course is finished as well. Hopefully I'll go a long way. Cut, that's it I think. That's a wrap. That's a wrap. All right, cut.